When mixing the amazing ClearCast by Lumilite Corporation, you want to mix this product one to one by volume and do not use a scale. When using our smaller kit, our 16 ounce kit, we do provide two small measuring cups for you to measure each side out. So slowly measure out each side. until you have equal amounts. And using a mixing cup that has flat sides or flat walls and a flat bottom, you can combine each side into your mixing cup. Make sure you scrape out your measuring container because leaving material in your mixing cup can throw you off ratio. Once you have each side combined into your mixing cup, you want to slowly mix this product. Amazing ClearCast has 30 minutes of open time, which is the amount of time they hit you have to pour it on your surface or pour it into a mold. By mixing too quickly, you can fold in a lot of air bubbles, which is usually what you do not want when using a clear resin. While stirring, you should be looking for both of those sides inside your cup to disappear so you don't see any striations between the two sides. You want to make sure to scrape the sides of your cup. You want to make sure you scrape the bottom. And lastly, scrape your stick off. Follow this process a couple times while you thoroughly mix the resin. The entire mixing process should take a minimum two to three minutes. Failing to mix the Amazing Clear Cast properly will result in a tacky surface. Once you're confident that you have the Amazing Clear Cast mixed thoroughly, you have the ability to let it sit for five or ten minutes to allow the air bubbles to rise to the surface and escape before you pour it down into your project. If you're mixing larger volumes of Amazing Clear Cast, it's a good idea not to mix any more than a half gallon to a gallon at one time and utilize larger mixing containers and measuring containers that can be found on the Illumilite website under Tools and Equipment. You'll also find that the A side of the Amazing Clear Cast is a lot thicker than the B side. So if you're emptying the entire bottles, make sure you give more time for the A side to drain out completely versus the B side. You always want to make sure you stay on that one to one mix ratio by volume.